Welcome back to our YouTube channel. I have a very interesting topic for you today. And we were retained, obviously, by lots of clients charged with sexual assault, serious crimes, aggravated assault. And the first question they asked me is, Mike, can you keep my name out of the media? The real short answer to that is no, unfortunately. In Canada, we have freedom of the press. It's guaranteed by the Canadian Charter of Rights and Freedoms. So, for example, the, the newspapers can publish your name. They can write about the allegations, what the charges are. And, you know, we represent some high-profile clients and, and their names are splashed across uh, the media and, and it's really a stressful situation. It's effectively can, can ruin people's lives because when, when there's an accusation, a lot of people don't presume that you're innocent. So that's, that's the short answer, unfortunately. There's one narrow exception to it. If you have a bail hearing, and most of our clients don't have bail hearings, so at a bail hearing, you can ask for what's called a non-publication order. So at a bail hearing, when the Crown's trying to keep you in custody, they call evidence, and the press is not allowed to publish that evidence, but they're still allowed to publish your name and the allegations. So what can you do with this? What do we advise people? Well, we say, look, this is a stressful situation. We're going to guide you through it. I advise clients stay off social media, go limit your privacy settings just to your, no one actually, I would advise people to completely get off social media, talk to no one, ignore the press, don't read it because it's gonna be stressful. And you have to go for your family support systems to get you through it and, and talk to us. Of course, we'll guide you through the process and try and get you the best result and hopefully win your case. So there you have it. That's the short primer on the, the unfortunate answer that no, you can't keep your name out of the media when you've been charged with a crime in Canada. It's guaranteed by the Canadian Charter of Rights and Freedoms, the freedom of the press. Thank you for watching our video. We are absolutely committed to bringing you the best possible criminal and DUI educational videos. If you found this video helpful, please like it and subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you've been charged with a criminal offense in Ontario and require our services, please click on the link in the description below.